Hi, my name is Aniera Matthews, and I'm the Research Services Librarian for the Douglas and Henry Academic Centers. And today, I will be showing you how to search your novelist K-8+, which is a database that gives book recommendations for different age groups. This database is perfect for education students and teachers who want to find new and diverse books to include in their curriculum. So to get to Novelist K-8, we're going to go to the library homepage, and the website is libraries.mercer.edu. And then once you get to the homepage, you're going to go to this databases A through Z tab. Okay, so when you get to this page right here, you are going to select the letter N. And then you will scroll down until you see Novelist K-8+. And sometimes before you get to this page, you might see a login page. Um, that just means you have to log in with your student ID number and your password that you use for Canvas. So once you do all of that, you, you will come to this page right here. And so this is where you can start browsing for different books. So the first thing over here to the left is this recommended read list. They have like a list of groups or like age groups that you can search by. So they have teens. Um, ages 9 through 12, and ages 0 through 8. And they have all these different categories that you can choose from. And they also have fiction and like nonfiction as well, if you want to look in that section. And then over here, you also have a list of titles as well that you can search by based on age group. So they have one for teens, they have one for ages 9 through 12, and one for ages zero through eight. So you can click on these tabs right here based on anyone that interests you. And you can see like all the books that they recommend for that particular like genre. And you can also search by genres right here. So you can search for teens, nine through 12, and also um, zero through eight. So if we just click on this tab, you will see a list of different genres that come up and you can kind of just search through to see which books interest you or that you want to share with your students. And then if we go back, you can also search for books based on the type of award that they've received. So if you hit on browse awards, you will see a list of different awards that you can search for based on age group. So you click on, I'm just going to click on this one, the National Book Award for Young People's Literature. You will see a list of books that appear by like award year and they give you all the books that have won for that particular year. And also like run reps or like the honor list. And then up here, this also gives you like a description of the award as well. And then another thing that you can do is you can do an advanced search if you wanted to. So some of the, these are the filters down here that you can choose from. So you can choose from the publication date, award winner. You can limit it by age group over here to the right. If you want to see reviews, you can also check this review box. And you can also search by the number of pages as well. Another cool thing that they have in this database is the Lexa range. If you're looking for books for students who are on a particular reading level, then you can use this filter right here. And they also have books by Accelerated Reader as well over here to the right. So you can also search that way too. Another thing that I really like in this database is the author's cultural identity. So if you wanted to include like more diverse books in your curriculum, then you can definitely search by the author's um, identity. So when you click on a book, you get information about the book. So you can see like the description of the book. You can see whether it has like illustrations and like the grade level and the Lexile like, level. Another thing you can see here too are the reviews. So you can see all of different all of the different re reviews that this book has received. So they have reviews on Booklist, the School Library Journal, Publishers Weekly, and Kirkus. Sometimes you might see all of these, but sometimes you might just see one or two reviews but you can definitely check that section as well just to see like what critics are saying about the book and there's also this goodreads option right here too to look at reviews from like other readers and possibly even some teachers who reviewed this book so you can click on that goodreads link and it'll redirect you to all of the reviews okay so if you scroll down here you will see like all of the reviews from different people who have read this book 
And another section that you can check out as well is over here to the right that has reader likes. So if you wanted to look at some similar books to this one, you can just look into this section right here. And if you wanted to know more about this book, you can. I think this just gives more information about like the publisher information, page numbers, the characters, like all of that kind of stuff. So this is also good as well if you need it. And if you wanted to search for a book, you could also do that as well. So I'm just going to type in a title. So yeah, so you type in a book and it should come up and you get all the information about the book as well. Okay, so that is how you use Novelist K-8+. through I hope this tutorial was really helpful. If you have any questions, you can always visit our Ask a Librarian page. So if you go to our homepage, you can scroll down to this Ask a Librarian tab. And on this page, you can contact us. So we're available via chat, Zoom. Um, you can email us or you can also set up a research consultation. And that is all. Thanks for watching.